Hello, and welcome to a Wednesday edition of Robert vs. the New York Times Crossword. Today we're going to do the Wednesday, March 29th, 2023 Crosswords. Go for that 1125 day streak. Got my new webcam, hoping it works today for this video. If not, I'll be very sad. Anyway, here's your spoiler alert for the Wednesday Mini. If you'd like to play along, pause the video here, click on the link in the description below. The Mini is always free to play. Alright, let's do it. Uh, etc. Uh, polls. I'd say, uh, curve? No. Tofu. Uh, clerk. Uh, this is a sled, I feel. Whoops. Kid and Levi. Alright, little, little issues with navigation as well as just entering the wrong thing. I wouldn't have known Zachary Levi, to be honest. So, he did all the crosses anyway. Yep. Anyway, now for the main event. That's the Wednesday Daily Grid, which is by Ben Zoon today. Here is your spoiler alert. If you'd like to play along, pause the video here, click on the link in the description below. The Daily Grid does require a New York Times game subscription. All right, let's see what uh, Ben Zoon has in store for us. Let's get into it. Entertain and details, please. Maybe and? Fasteners near hasps. Door hinges? I don't know. Be amused is what I want. Is this a UFO? Glass and crate are surfaces twined together, enlaced, maybe? Maybe it's door latches. This is an interception, and could be a lot of Apple products. But this is Ernst Mach, aches for, bargain bin finds. This is a nacho, some scrubbers, okay? Vocational training provider, call upon, foretell, and friends and associates. Okay, wish undone, maybe rue, door latches here, ripen just age, this is my peeps maybe, this is far, the RLC, dormant, bracelet has a charm, those are both arrows, this is uh, some kind of megawatt hour or something, no, D-back, kilowatt hour, specialized tableware, taco, Something. Dos plus seis is ocho. Groundbreakers. Pioneers, maybe? This is N sync. Root for cheer on. Tall or short order. Uh, could be a teddy. Challenge for a firework walker. Red hot coals. Farm structure and. This is a sty. Lead. Vote for is I. This is needy. Newsroom folks, maybe. Eds, like galleys. This is solvent. Uh, pad, see you. Say when? Uh, are you serious? This is spade, ord. Just taco holders here. That's a really bad way to navigate there. Uh, this is data cap. Ross Perot, cited. Uh, uh, Polis, is he professional as a CPA? This is a Tyler, Rogue One, I actually watched that. This is Antied, spelled wrong of course. Yoga's balancing stance, some kind of pose, surely. I think Tesla driver doesn't need to carry. A fuel can, the, an Alp, Nat, Kneeled here. Did okay. It's rides, surely. SOS pads. These are I do's. Cheapies. Uh, spacers. Auger. Heaped up. Trade school. Then penne and tree pose. Alright. So we've got a pretty simple conceptual theme. Nice little spiraling femurs. They must be length 11. They are, of course, all the same length because they're all anagrams. So this is just a quadruple anagram find. Door latches, trade school, red hot coals, and taco holders. Of course, taco holders here is the one that seems the least in the language. I mean, I, I know 
what they're talking about, like at a restaurant. Taco holder. I guess that's the name of it. I wondered if these things had a name. Taco stand? I would call it a taco stand, but maybe a taco stand is like a a place where you buy tacos. Okay, interesting. I mean, conceptually it's uh, very simple, but it is interesting. Yeah, of course the, the lengths are going to work, right? But not clued in a particular clever way or anything, but that's I think that's totally fine. I mean, I'd probably prefer it. If it was clued in some kind of hokey way, I might like it less. Uh, and not much to say about the theme. It's interesting. I wonder, I wonder how many more of these there are. Yeah, I think you could pretty easily write code to go through your word list. Probably want to limit it to like 9, 10, 11 length things. And then just see how many of how many of them are anagrams for each other. How many of them have the same multi-set of characters or whatever. Anyway, let's look through this thing. I think it's lots of apples have chips. iPads, I iPhones, iPods, iMacs. Yeah, you might tap your vice president, for example. Data cap is interesting. It's certainly a legitimate thing. I like the clue on bracelet, because you might have a charm bracelet. Yeah, polis. Like metropolis or acropolis, which I guess means high polis. You front a band, interesting. Rogue one, I thought was okay. I know people sort of I feel like they hold it up as like the best Disney Star Wars product. Sadly, that might be true. Um, Pad C U, look at those three E's. I like it. I also like eating it. So yeah, the uh, the non-theme long stuff so far looks pretty good. Cheapies. That's definitely a, a word, but. To auger means to foretell. I feel like you so rarely see it, though. Portend a good or bad outcome. Oh, it can also be used as a noun in the classical Roman world. world. Yeah. So, maybe you, you don't see it that often since the classical Roman world came to an end. The heirs of the diamondbacks. Nice. Mixing up the cluing with, like, a Basically some ASCII art. Yeah, not, not the biggest fan of did okay. But but it's okay. Yeah, was there some other Tesla clue somewhere? Kilowatt hour. Oh, EV battery capacity unit. When I got to here, I thought, is this thing, is this thing sponsored by Tesla? Yeah, uh, I, I think it's interesting. I'd like to know how many more of these one could find. It's not a, it's not a crazy interesting concept, but it's a nice find. Um, nice shout out to you, Ben Zoon. You, I would say kind of quick for a Wednesday. I kind of hope Wednesdays take about four minutes. Uh, <laughs> yeah, anyway, next thing we should do is the plus word. So here is your spoiler alert for the plus word. If you'd like to play along, pause the video here, click on the link in the description below. Pulse Word's free to play. It's British. It's a mini crossword meets Wordle. Diagram, maybe a graph. Scope. Maxim, that could be like Axiom or something, and that could be Piled. Grips, holds. Wireless, that's just a radio. Taken together. That could be range. An adage, piled, and holds in all. Uh, this is grief, I guess. Egged on. Feeds, okay. So, where does the G go? I guess, thing? Thing, indeed. Switch over here. 
Yeah, I do think calling a radio a wireless, that actually is a Britishism. In crosswords, when something is clued as a saying, I never know whether to put adage or axiom or maxim. Uh, but today it was just adage in this one. Yeah, so maybe the, the, the wireless here, being radio, is a bit British, but otherwise very doable by an American solver. And anyway, the last thing we do here is check the mini leaderboard for tomorrow, where we've got Orioana in 40 seconds. Shout out to you, Orioana. I wonder where Stickers is. Maybe just hanging out or something. And on the old secret leaderboard, we have nobody yet. Hope you're all enjoying your Tuesday evening. Um, thanks for watching. Thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And I'll see you tomorrow for the best day of the week for some Thursday puzzles. See you then.